Hello everyone, my name is Bash and welcome to my channel. This channel will be mostly about Dead by Daylight game. I have more than 3000 hours in this game, playing survival mostly. Today I'm starting a series in which I will be talking about every survival 3 teachable perks and I will be giving my opinion on them. Let's start with Dwight Fairfield 3 teachable perks. His first perk is Where the fuck are my teammates? Also known as Bomb. The second perk is Gen Rushing is okay. Also called Ruthaisa. And the last perk is Hey You. Which is also called Leader. Now let's go back to Bond and explain what it does. Allies are revealed to you when they are within a range of 20, 28, 36 meters, depending on the tier you have. So when someone is within 36 meters, you will see their yellowish or You can unlock this perk on other survivors when you reach level 30 on Dwight, or you can unlock it if it's at the shrine. Now, my opinion on point. I think this is one of the best perks of your solo. It provides you with information on if someone getting chased so you can walk in a gen safe if someone walking on a gen so you can help them finish it faster and there are a lot more information I give it a 4 out of 5 stars Prove thyself Now before I start talking about prove thyself you need to know how long does it take to finish a generator for one survivor it takes 80 seconds If two survivors are working on a generator it takes 47 seconds 3 38 seconds 4 36 seconds Now let's explain what Proof Thyself does For each survivor other than you gain a stackable 15% repair speed buff Awarded to all repairing survivors within a range of 4 meters to a maximum of 45%. Also, gain 50, 75, 100% more blood points for cooperative action. Proof thyself does not stay. Now, with Proof thyself speed buff, if 2 survivors are working on a generator, it takes 40 seconds. Or 41 seconds. 3 survivor 29 seconds. 4 survivor 25 seconds. I think it's an okay part. Not too good, not too bad. You can use it if you want to get more blood points or if you feel like you're losing because gens are not getting done faster. I give it a 3 out of 5 stars. Leader Increases the other survivors healing, sabotage, unhooking, cleansing, exit gate opening, and chest searching speeds by 15, 20, 25, depending on the tier you have. When they are within a range of 8 meters from you. Survivors can only be affected by one leader effect at a time. This effect persists on other survivors for 15 seconds after leaving the leader's brain. Leader does not stack. So, let's talk about healing. Healing takes 16 seconds. If you are using leader on someone else's healing you, it takes 12 seconds. If two survivors are healing you, it takes 8 seconds. Same goes for everything else. It reduces the time to do an action. It's not that good, to be honest. There are more useful perks to use. I gave it 2.5 stars out of 5 stars. Now I will play a few games to show you the perks in game.
the white perks are okay the only good perk is bond which is amazing for solid anyway that's it for the video i hope you guys enjoyed and learned something don't forget to click that subscribe button because my next video will be on mac thomas and hair 3 teach world parts like and comment down below what do you think about white teach world are they good or are they bad and i will see you guys in the next video